Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and we have more news about the Edge Chromium browser that will be released this week. In an interesting move, Microsoft has announced that Windows 7 will get updates to the Edge Chromium browser for at least 18 months. That's kind of following in the footsteps of Google Chrome basically. So Google, of course, had mentioned that Windows 7 would have at least 18 months of updates for the web browser. So it's interesting to see that Microsoft is imitating and saying, hey, we're going to at least have 18 months of uh, updates. This is interesting also because the fact that Windows 7, you know, I, I think we're all still surprised that Microsoft did a Microsoft Edge Chromium for Windows 7. But it's surprising also that it's actually, well, it's not surprising because they, if they developed Windows uh, an Edge Chromium for Windows 7, it's, of course, to have it living for a certain time. So 18 months, and, of course, uh, that is going to be the official browser released by Microsoft starting this Wednesday. I want to answer two questions that uh, viewers have sent me regarding the uh, Edge Chromium browser. So first of all, I get one question uh, that is, um, will this mean the end of Internet Explorer 11? Well, Internet Explorer 11 is still, uh, still exists. It's not installed by default within Windows 10. You need to go and actually install it yourself if you want it. But it is available within the uh, you know Windows programs and features where you can actually click and add the uh, extra software if you want. And Internet Explorer 11 is part of it. So, no, it's not replacing or eliminating uh, when, uh, Internet Explorer 11. A lot of you are still wondering why Internet Explorer 11 exists, and it's really because of enterprise. There's a lot of uh, you know. Uh, features and a lot of interconnections that actually require some of the modules that Internet Explorer has because of the way it was actually integrated within Windows. The other question is, is it going to autom automatically replace my Edge browser that I have right now? Um, it technically should replace the Edge browser and push the Edge browser kind of in a very um, you know, hidden spot where you shouldn't see it. The idea behind Edge Chromium is to really replace the, the, the normal Edge. And of course, uh, another question that some have asked is, why don't they just remove Edge, the old Edge? They can't because some apps in the Microsoft Store actually require the old Edge to work. So that's why the old Edge needs to stay in, but it's going to be hidden from view. And this is going to be what people are going to see. Of course, we'll see the rollout on Wednesday. Uh, this is going to be interesting to see where and what it does. Um, but, uh, you know, I think it's going to be an okay rollout. I mean, uh, I've been uh, testing the developer and Canary versions, and they were great, actually. Although, yes, there are probably a few features missing. So, uh, 18 months of support for Edge Chromium on Windows 7. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.